up is Chachi and as from the title you can see that I'm gonna do this whole get ready with me type thing I'm about to start doing my makeup because I'm about to film my Q&A and I was like why not do one of these things I decided this after I already moisturized and primed so I'm just gonna jump right into it I moisturize with a Kiehl, I think that's how you say it, moisturizer so it's actually for men um, Josh got it and he didn't really like it because he thought it was too tingly or whatever he has sensitive skin but I like it, it wakes me up I just hope it doesn't make me grow a beard and I moisturize with my perfect professional by benefit. I am not a professional makeup artist by all means. Um, this is just kind of how I do my makeup. Um, it works for me. I mix between high-end products and drugstore products just because I just found that works for my skin. My skin's kind of weird with certain high-end products and certain drugstore products. If you see the switch, sorry. First thing I'm going to do is, after I already primed and stuff, I'm going to just put my foundation on. Usually if I do a darker colored eye, I will start with my eyes first, but since I'm going to go a little more like easy on the eyes today, I'm just going to go straight into my foundation. So I use a Neutrogena foundation that has like, acne treatment in it because I have a lot of breakouts because, you know, I dance and I sweat, but I have to wear makeup and, you know, I just have crazy skin. And I've used like NARS and MAC and like all kinds of other foundations and they just really are harsh on my skin. So this one's just really light and it has good coverage that you can build up. Just gonna go ahead. This is in the color Buff 30. And yeah, I just go in with a brush and um, start doing that all over my face. I kind of just let it happen everywhere. It might look like a lot on camera, but I promise it's like super thin. About it for that part. So next I go in with my, what do I do? I feel like I forgot how to do my makeup. Um, I take my Anastasia Contour Cream Kit. I'm warning you, this has been through a lot because it lasts me forever, so it's kind of like, you know. I go in with the pink color and put that under my eyes because I have crazy under eye circles and I feel like I have to kind of cancel it out. I don't know, I learned it off of YouTube. So I'm just gonna pat that under my eye just really lightly, not crazy amount. I always go to Josh after I do this and be like, look what happened to my eyes. He doesn't fall for it. <laughs> and then after that, I go in with my Ben Nye concealer in the color Ultra Fair. I don't know where I got this like little beauty blender stick sponge thing, but I love it and I always use it for my under eyes. So just gonna dot some of that in there and then um, just go over that. I always have like a lot of trouble finding good concealers because my under eyes get really really dry and it would get like really blotchy so I found that I had to like put eye cream on before I do my concealer and it helps and it doesn't get blotchy but then some of them are just like really hard to not be blotchy and then I just kind of take that down my door and around and my chin there I just go over my eyes actually. I sometimes use a eyeshadow primer, the Urban Decay one. Concealer seems to work the same for me, so that's kind of how I do it. I know I look crazy right now. <laughs> so, hair on my face. Where is it? So then after I do that, I only contour my nose and my forehead. I don't like to contour my cheeks with the cream contour because as my skin is so fair, it ends up looking like dirt at the end. So I just go in with some bronzer later on, but we'll get to that. So I'm just gonna... So I'm just gonna go in with that middle like brownie color. Brownie. I want a brownie. And I'm just gonna go along the sides and like under. I really feel like so many people were like in this bathroom right now like watching me like you better not mess up So then I kind of feel like a lion when I do that or like a, a bear or something <laughs> I just kind of a rainbow on my forehead After that I just go in with this buffing brush. I think this is real techniques blend that out It always makes my nose water I'm gonna buff the rest of this out too And then if I feel like it's a little too like I don't know. I just kind of go in with whatever foundation is left to kind of um, to blend that out. Ta da! We're done with that part. Next to set my face, I go in with my Revlon translucent powder and just the big brush. Just you know, put that all over my face. <laughs> <laughs> That's just for my face and then for my under eyes I go in with this Maybelline Fit Me in the color 110 Porcelain So then I take this for under my eyes Just everywhere that I placed that concealer earlier too Oh, Something in my contact I hate putting on makeup on my contacts but then I can't put it on after Because then my eyes water and then my makeup runs and it's just 
you know, life is hard for the blind. Okay, so then after I set my whole face, do my brows next. Sorry guys, I didn't get to clean my makeup brushes um, after I used them yesterday. So there's kind of, I don't know what happens overnight. <laughs> I'm just gonna brush my brows out. I'm using this Anastasia thingy. Everyone has one of these. <laughs> I don't use like a brow pencil or a special brow powder just because I just use an eyeshadow and I always use an eyeshadow and I don't know why I don't use like the proper, you know, product for my eyebrows, but it works for me. I got this like Morphe palette for Christmas and um, there's this brown color in there and <sighs> this one I use and it's just like a, a dark brown. Since my eyebrows are really dark, I just like to keep them that color because I like the whole like blonde hair, dark brows thing. Here we go. I just stay along the natural shape of my brows since my eyebrows are pretty um, hairy. <laughs> and then I just brush it out so that it doesn't look so like sharp and like, you know, you know. You know. <laughs> my right eyebrow always gives me problems because it just never wants to cooperate and I always have to tell myself in the mirror, eyebrows are sisters, not twins. But then sometimes I feel like my right eyebrow is like a third cousin on your cousin's side or I don't know, you know? It just doesn't want to get with the program. I don't really do crazy eyeshadow either. Um, I usually, like my go-to look, which I'm probably gonna do today, um, I take my um, Give Me Sun MAC um, bronzer and I just put that all I just blend that out on my eye and uh, that's really the only thing that I'll do don't judge me it's not done yet and then um, I just take a big fluffy brush and then I just blend my life away blending is key they don't want you to blend I haven't even seen those videos I don't know why I made that joke Boom. So I just did that and um, I, it's really all I'm gonna do. Sometimes I'll take like a, like a darker brown color and just kind of swift that along my lash line. After I curl my lashes, I just put some eyelash glue on like this and just let that dry. I don't like putting it directly on the lash because sometimes it globs out too much. This lets it like get tacky before I put it on. So then I just curl my lashes. I flew first class on um, JetBlue and they gave us like these care packages for the flight and for the women's bag, it had like this mascara in it and I've never heard of it. It's called, it just is like, it has an E on it and it says Black Magic Mascara. I don't know, but I love it and I've been using it and I have no idea what it is, but I'm just gonna lightly um, just coat my lashes before I apply falsies. I feel like it hasn't dried long enough, so I'm just gonna round my face and stuff and um, Just gonna take that same bronzer that I used on my eyes and this is how I contour my face I'm gonna go in with this blush Richard Gina one in the color 10 rosy so then I don't really like super pink cheeks. I'll blend it out <laughs> Hold it down. My baby hairs are insane right now. Go in with my Anastasia Glow Kit and I take the color Crushed Pearl. I don't know why I needed a sound effect for that. <laughs> Along my nose. So now I'm just gonna put my lashes on. I just dip the tip of this brush, like handle thingy, and um, I just put it along. Oh, and then sometimes, because I don't put a lot of mascara on, because my bottom lashes are really long, and it just kind of looks weird sometimes when I put mascara on them, so I just go under with the same color. Sometimes I don't do lip, so I'll just put some lip balm on. I'll probably end up putting like a, a light pink color on, but for now, just moisturize. That is how I do my makeup. I hope you guys enjoyed this video so much. If you like these kinds of things, um, a thumbs up and comment below. Don't forget to follow my social media. It'll be in the link in the description below. Um, yeah, tell me what you guys want to see next. And until next time, I love you. Bye. There's my toilet. <laughs> guys, not even kidding. I just knocked over my palette finishing this video. <laughs> There's been a death in the family. I'm shitting for my